Hello everyone, welcome to Terra Spatial. In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to do aspect or slope direction in QGIS using digital elevation model DEM. So as per the QGIS training manual, aspect is the compass direction that a slope of a terrain faces. An aspect of 0 means that the slope is north facing, 90 means east facing, 180 means south facing and 270 is west facing. So you can see here according to the QGIS training manual. So the north direction is from 0 to 45 and 315 to 360. The direction east is from 45 to 135. The south direction is from 135 to 225. And finally the west direction is 225 to 315. So this is based on the QGIS training model training manual if you want to classify it uh, into furthermore direction so I have just uh, found it in the ESRA website they have classified you can see here for flat terrain minus 1 north direction 0 to 22.5 degrees so further they have classified it so I'll be giving this uh, document in the link you can download this so let us see how to how to uh, find the aspect in QGIS or slope direction. So let us first add our raster layer. So this is the dem data. So if you don't know how to download dem data, I have ma made a video on it. So I'll be uh, giving it in the description as well as I will be putting in the cards you can just check it out so I have downloaded from the USGS website SRTM data which is of a 30 meter resolution so this is the digital elevation model DEM data so now go to the option raster here go to the option analysis and select aspect so here in the input layer we need to select the DEM file so here you can see aspect you can save the file location if you want it to have it as a temporary file you can just select save to temporary file otherwise you can browse and select the desired location where it has to be saved so here I am going to save it as aspect and let me save now hit the button run so you can see the aspect has been successfully completed let me close this you can see the aspect value so it is uh, ranging from 0 to 359.66 so now right click and go to the option properties so you can see the minimum value is 0 and the maximum value is 359.669 so now let me close this and here in the processing toolbox if you don't find this processing toolbox here you can just click on this button it will be coming over here and here select reclass reclassify by table so you can see here reclassify by table so my input uh, raster will be aspect and here you can find the option uh, reclassification table select this button and now we are going to add uh, rows so I am going to add 4 rows and finally 1 so why am I, I am adding this row I uh, let me explain this so once again going back to the uh, word document here you can see that the based on the QGIS user manual the north direction is 0 to 45 so this is 45 to 135 so likewise these values we are going to input in this uh, raster reclassify table so first is 0 to 45 and that is north then 45 to 135 East one 
225 south 225 315 so that will be west finally 315 so 315 to 360 degree is also comes at the north so let me click ok so now we have just classified it accordingly you can see here 1 is 0 to 45 degrees 2 is 45 to 135 degrees so now let us uh, click ok and we can just save the file if you want to you can, you can have it in the temporary file otherwise you can save it to a particular location slope direction save the file click run so here it told me some error so i have uh, put the uh, instead of values i have put a uh, text so that is that is the problem so let me correct it so let us give values and try to remember it 3 4 5 so 0 to 45 degrees north 45 to 135 is east 135 to 225 is south 225 to 315 is west and 315 to 360 uh, is north once again so here instead of a uh, direction uh, i am just giving it in values because uh, 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 it has to be given in values so we just remember one is nothing but north two is nothing but east and three is nothing but south four is nothing but west and finally five is north so this has been uh, classified based on this okay now let me click ok and now let me run it so as you can see here this time has been successfully processed so now let us go back you can see it has been classed 0 to 5 properties here select unique values and hit the button classify so you can see here we have got the values 1 2 3 4 so now let us label it 1 is nothing but the north direction 2 is east direction 3 is south direction 4 is west and 5 is north okay so this is uh, based on the uh, we have given the uh, value ranges for each uh, value 0 to 45 we have assigned the value as 1 then uh, likewise 45 to 135 we have assigned value 2 likewise we have done so now let me apply it and click ok so you can see here this is a uh, northward uh, facing slope the yellow color represents east direction so likewise you can calculate the slope aspect or slope uh, direction the same can be done for example here it is uh, done based on the QGIS value if you uh, want to further further uh, classify it into uh, north northeast east southeast likewise you can just use this uh, values you can just classify it from the esri value they have given it uh, they have added some more directions so th for them 0 to 22.5 is north 22.5 to 67.5 is northeast likewise you can add some more so i'll be putting this document in the link you can just check it out thanks for watching goodbye everyone